Welcome back to the John Mandola Show on WILK. Well, a lot of coaches versus cancer games last night. Scranton Prep victorious over West Scranton. We'll get with Andrew Kettle coming up probably in the next uh, oh, 10 or 15 minutes here. Uh, so we'll, we'll get to him, talk to him about the effort this year for coaches versus cancer. Right now, let's talk Northwest Area Girls Basketball. Scott Miners, the head coach, coming in. And uh, Scott, welcome to the show today. Thanks, John. Thanks for having us. Well, uh, let's talk about some of the successes we've seen from the Lady Rangers on the court this year and uh, how much fun you have in coaching these young ladies. Um, right now, I'm having a lot of fun. Uh, it's been a little bit different for me uh, coming from the uh, college men's game, and uh, but uh, I'm having a lot of fun right now coaching a, a great group of young ladies, and uh, they work really hard every single day when they come to practice, so I have no complaints right now with them at all. Let's talk about uh, see you coaching little kids at, at gyms and doing different things. The game of basketball is something, obviously, it's in the blood, you and your brother. And take us through some of those younger days of, of why basketball is so important to you and how you kind of grew up with it. Well, we kind of grew up uh, just a sports family. Uh, my dad and uh, played for Myers and and uh, played baseball and basketball there. And so we uh, once we moved to Northwest and and got a part of uh, Coach Gajewski and and playing there and uh, myself and my brothers and uh, my sister. We were all athletes playing basketball and and uh, baseball and and other sports. So it was kind of something that we grew up with every single day and. Um, it was a big part of our lives, a big part of our families. Uh, being together on uh, game night was always something special. And special it is, uh, the game of basketball, that's for sure. Uh, everything that's going on with it here in northeastern Pennsylvania. Coach, we have a couple young ladies we're going to talk to today. And, and the first one we're going to talk to is Reagan Harrison. So tell us a little bit about Reagan and, and what she brings to the court for you. Well, Reagan brings, uh, she played last year uh, quite a bit as a freshman. And... Um, she brings uh, a lot of uh, outside shooting for us and also just uh, court awareness as, uh, as to what's going on. And uh, she communicates really well uh, on the floor uh, offensively and defensively uh, and, and tries to get uh, things done that we try to accomplish during practice and also uh, during the games. All right, let's welcome in Reagan Harrison here on the John and Dola Show. And, uh, Reagan, you're, you're a sophomore, so... Talk a little bit about what it's like playing there at Northwest and, and playing with some of the uh, the older classmen there. Playing as a sophomore is a lot of fun. I have a lot of older friends, so we kind of just bond and everything works well for us. Also a uh, softball player there. So uh, talk about uh, what you enjoy about the game of softball. Uh, I've played softball since I was little, so it just kind of is a fun activity for me to do. Much like uh, Coach Miner's story about an athletic family, uh, recognizing some of your siblings. I know they played some sports as well. So take us through all the, the, the family and, and what everybody's up to nowadays. My family's been really close. We all bond over sports. We watch sports. We all play. So it's kind of been just a thing for us my whole life. Um, my brother plays football at Wilkes right now. So it's fun to always watch him. All right, and that's uh, Bryce? Yep. All right. And uh, what's Tyler doing? Tyler went to lineman school, so he's working and having a really fun time with that. Well, that's a, a challenging job, that's for sure, <laughs> a yeah. lineman. But uh, we'll talk about uh, what uh, the future for him is going to be, a very bright side in the in the pay scale uh, as you work in that field. How about Jordan? What's he up to? Uh, that's my sister, actually. Sorry, yeah, Jordan, your sister. I apologize. Yeah, she's uh, a senior right now, so we're still together playing, and that's a lot of fun. And uh, what do you think Jordan brings on the court? Uh, or, you know, that you have or she doesn't have? Uh, what's the, the combination like? Well, she's definitely working very hard to get all the rebounds. So she gets them. She gets them out to me or Brenna Babcock, and we just go with it. You're doing real well in the classroom, uh, about a 95 or so, uh, honor roll, uh, math, one of those favorite subjects. Talk about uh, what you enjoy in the classroom. Uh, I don't know. School kind of just comes easy for me. I feel like I don't really have a lot of struggles. Well, you're lucky. <laughs> a medical field down the road, uh, as far as uh, have you honed in on one particular area, you're kind of a little open on that. I'm pretty open. I mean, my dad went into nursing, so I'm kind of looking into that a little bit. All right, Reagan. Well, we appreciate uh, hearing your story and wish you the very best. Thank you. Okay, Reagan Harrison there from the Northwest area. Lady Rangers, let's get back to Coach Miner and uh, Coach with another young lady to talk about, Trista Babcock. Yeah, Trista... Um 
Trista's a, a an outstanding young lady, and she's she's the um, jack of all trades uh, player on our basketball team. Uh, she kind of does a little bit of everything. She's actually led us in rebounding the last couple games, and but she can handle the ball pretty well, and and she can shoot it pretty well, and and uh, she's a very good passer, and and uh, is a is a very good uh, defender when she's engaged in in the game, and. And uh, she's somebody I rely on a lot, and um, I, I expect a lot from her. All right. Well, let's welcome in Trista Babcock here on the John and Dola Show. And uh, Trista, you're a junior, so let's talk about your role on the team. Um, I'm definitely more defensive-minded. Um, my sister Brenna just got her 1,000 points. Um, she's kind of more of a shooter. but What was it like uh, being there with your sister when uh, she just scored her 1,000 points? I think that was, what, Thursday night maybe? Yeah, she was very excited. I was happy for her. It was a cool thing to watch. And uh, another softball player. And, uh, of course, you, you girls like to stay busy and, and do a lot of positive stuff. So uh, a lot of the girls on the basketball team play softball? Yeah, that's nice. We all get along. We pretty much play all the same sports, so we see each other year-round. How about the softball coach? How do you get along with him? Um, Good. Um, He's definitely improved our team the past couple of years. All right, let's talk a little bit about uh, – the siblings and the family, and you mentioned a little bit about Brenna, and there's another one, right? Yeah, my brother Colton. Okay, and what's Colton up to? Um, he's in the wrestling right now. Um, he's been doing really well. He's a senior. All right, pretty cool. English, one of your favorite uh, sports? Um, I'm not a very big fan of school, but if I had to pick one, I guess it would be English. All right, English, one of the favorite subjects, not one of sports, but uh, Hanover, one of the, the good rivalries. Uh, what is it l- uh, p- like playing against the Lady Hawkeyes? Um, it's definitely a challenge every time we're on the court with them. They have a lot of tall players, which we don't have. So, And as far as uh, things with your team, what do you like about your team when you're out there? Would you say uh, hardworking, uh, feisty, a lot of good shooters? What are, what are some things that you see as the attributes uh, for the Lady Rangers that has gotten you a, a bunch of wins so far? We have kind of a little bit of everything. We have um, rebounders. We have Brennan and Reagan, which are really good shooters. Um like everybody just kind of plays their own part and it all comes together all right very good well we appreciate your time today trista thank you okay trista babcock or sister uh brenna scored a 1000th career point uh, the other night for northwest area so a big congratulations to her we come back here on the john mandola show we're going to continue the conversation with the northwest area lady rangers then we'll get with uh, andrew kettle out of scranton prep and the coaches versus cancer again follow us online the john show.com a couple of games coming up on youtube live this week including the holy cross lady crusaders and riverside lady bikes that's going to be on monday so just follow us on youtube the john mandola show you'll be able to watch that game live on monday when riverside hosts holy cross let's take a time out and uh, head over to our local State Farm insurance agent, Frank Sorokatch. Break like a good neighbor. Frank Sorokatch is here. We'll be back on WILK. Welcome back to the John Mandola Show here on WILK. Continuing the conversation with the Northwest Area Lady Rangers basketball program. And, of course, our uh, head coach, Scott Miner, with us today. And, uh, Scott, we have a, a young lady we're going to be talking to, uh, Danielle Bowman, today. And uh, she's on the phone. We'll get with her in a moment. But uh, tell us a little about Danielle's attributes for the Lady Rangers. Danielle's a, a senior, and, and she's one of our leaders on the basketball court. Um, she works extremely hard uh, every single day, and um, she brings a lot of energy to our practice floor and um, is very, very competitive. She is uh, very competitive uh, one, in, during the basketball games and is a, a very good rebounder for us and uh, can make the open uh, – jump shot at the around the foul line area and things like that so she's a very very important part of our basketball team as far as bringing energy to us all right let's welcome in danielle bowman here on the john and dola show and uh, danielle good morning and uh, welcome into the show hi good morning well let's talk a little bit about uh being a busy young lady you do some cross country uh as well at northwest area but uh, what's it like playing basketball and being a senior um it, it gets very hard at times. You get in your head sometimes, but you always have the team to back you up. And, uh, of course, she had a teammate the other night score her 1,000th career point. What was that moment like for the whole team? It was very exciting. We were all very proud of her. Um, we were glad that she finally hit it. Uh, let's talk about your contributions there for your team. What, 
What uh, what does coach expect of you and say, uh, Danielle, this is what you need to do every single game? Probably rebounding, always keep always boxing everybody out, um, and playing our best. And as far as uh, school itself, uh, talk about you have a favorite subject or, or something you really enjoy there at Northwest Air? Um, I like the, the science there. It's very educational. And as far as the future for you, what do you have planned uh, going forward after high school? Um, I plan on going to college, going to LCC for two years, and then maybe another college for two more years. All right, cool. Well, uh, you're busy. Uh, you're doing a lot of good stuff there at Northwest Area, and uh, we appreciate your time today, Danielle. Thank you so much. All right, thank you. Danielle Bowman there from Northwest Area, and uh, Coach Miner getting back to you. And uh, here we are uh, getting towards the latter part of January. It's going to be starting to heat up. Do you feel like you played your best ball yet? I don't, I don't think so right now, John. Um, we've we've kind of uh, gone through the thing as a team. Uh, I, I talked to the girls early on and just let them know we're in a marathon. We're not in a sprint. And uh, we've really tried to concentrate on getting better every single day. Um, and we work on uh, different things every single day at practice and also different things uh, during the games. And uh, now that we're coming into uh, – the, the bottom third of the season, I guess you want to call it, or the, the final third. Um, I think I think our best basketball is still around the corner, and, and we're trying to push, obviously, toward the, uh, our division and, and the playoffs, and we have some tough games coming up with uh, Hanover and with uh, Wyoming Seminary, and um, hopefully we'll, we'll be able to um, compete in those games and, and push towards the, the district playoffs. Well, Coach, uh, it's great to hear about the Lady Rangers. We appreciate you you bringing the girls in, and great to hear that uh, Danielle Bowman uh, uh, story, and she's a senior and, and showing some leadership there at Northwest Area as well. So uh, appreciate it. Have a great weekend. All right. Thanks, John, for having us. All right. Scott Miner and the Northwest Area Lady Rangers here on the John Mandola Show. When we come back, we'll talk with Andrew Kettle. Let's take a time out. Let's head out now to our local State Farm Insurance Agent Jeremy Baczynski break. Like a good neighbor. Jeremy Baczynski is there. We'll be back at WILK.